right, let's talk. Christian influencers. Yeah. It's real simple, man. Are we in the word or are we trying to show people we're in the word? Now, what does that mean? I always talk about the idea that your faith, just like my faith encompasses everything I do. Like the things that make me who I am, I incorporate in every aspect of my life and my business. My, my, my wonderful, amazing wife, my awesome boys, my faith in God, my desire for <laughs> capitalism and, and growth, um, my belief in people as a whole. Like these are things that are that are that are me. Um, I love I love music. Music in, in, is incorporated in a lot of things I do. Um, I don't get sidetracked too much, but I want that's what I want to talk about. It's just the idea. It's like so. If you're an influencer, if you're someone who creates content, just like me on Facebook, on Instagram, YouTube, wherever you do it, should you incorporate your faith? Absolutely. Now, if you're a Christian influencer and you're you're not just an influencer who is a Christian, but your whole basis, your whole premise is the fact that you're a Christian, are you walking with God and just sharing that walk with others? Or are you trying to show people that you're in the word? Now, what I mean by that is, see, you'll see people do these things. Like we talked about this in one of my men's Bible studies when I was in Bend. It was really incredible. And we talked about the idea that, you know, you put your Bible out. You've got your you've got your Bible, your coffee, your little notepad. You make this whole thing and you take a picture. Then you post it on Facebook and Instagram and you say, look, look how good I am. I'm in the word, right? No, but are you in the word or are you trying to show people you're in the word? There's It's a complete different thing. If you're walking with God and you're walking in the word, then of course, share that. Share that. Be, be an influencer. Be an encourager. Be a minister. Be, you know, whatever it is you want to be. Create your content. Be an artist and, and incorporate your faith and your walk with God and, and, and the love of Jesus into the things that you're doing. But if all you're doing, if all you're doing is trying to get that pat on the back that, hey, I'm a good Christian. Look what I'm doing. Hey, look at me. I'm, I'm doing my Bible study for the day. If all you're doing is trying to check a box and get kudos for how great you're doing. You're missing the whole point. The point isn't so you can get acknowledgement. The point isn't so you can get credit. The point isn't so that way you can be a good Christian. The point is so you can actually develop a relationship with your father, with your heavenly father, with God, so you can walk in the word, so you can actually absorb the content and incorporate it into your daily life. There are scriptures, and you've seen me post many of them. There are scriptures about every aspect of your life. There's scriptures that, uh, that talk about finance. There's scriptures that talk about, you know, um, the, the, the things that, uh, the, the sin that boggles your mind, the distractions in life. There's sin about developing your faith. There's sin about loving your neighbor. I mean, sin. There's scripture about loving your neighbor. There's scripture. I kept saying the word sin. Uh, there's scripture about, uh, finances, business, um, being a strong partner, being a strong um, father, being a strong husband, being a strong business partner. There's there's so many scriptures that I pull out that I incorporate into my um, into my videos and into the content because I'm trying to help people build a better life and build financial freedom and grow their business and be a great entrepreneur. But that doesn't take away from the fact that I'm a Christian and that that is part of my walk. So I share those things because. If you're not a Christian, that's okay. That's, I'm not mad at you. I mean, I hope that you find God because I love you, because I care about you, because I want you to experience the amazing love of Jesus that I experience every day. But I'm not here to beat you over the head with it. I'm not here to, you know, say that you're doing anything wrong. Um, I'm here to offer some wisdom, some insight some tips about basic life principles and business practice so that way you can position yourself in a better place for the future. And because I find a lot of the insight that I have in God's word, I share God's word with you. There's a difference between being in God's word and trying to show people that you're in God's word. Let's do better.
I got love and respect for all y'all. Y'all have a blessed, amazing, awesome, outstanding day. Uh, it's your boy. Be sure to like and subscribe. Leave some uh, comments below. Make sure and ding your bell. Get your notification. Don't miss out. I got so much more for you. It's your boy and I'm out.